Hey, what's up, y'all? This is ASAP Ferg. I'm here with Genius, and I'm about to see which one of these New York rappers get my coat out. New York is like trendsetters. Like, when you think about the Bronx, that's where hip hop started. You think about Harlem, that's like fashion mecca. Brooklyn, you got all of the guys that's getting money. You got Queens, laid back Queens dudes. That's kind of like setting the whole vibe for like the coolness. And then you got Staten Island, Shaolin, Wu-Tang. They from another world, another planet, New York. That's us. On the block with my mans, hold the Glock in my pants. Throw the rock with my hands, throw it. I fuck with the Gap hoodies. We used to do Gap sweatsuits in Harlem. I see you got the silky on. I fuck with this swag. And my little bitch gave me brain and I skied on her face. Got my mask in my <laughs> the dance. They remind me of like what New Brooklyn is like. As far as like Takashi, GS9, Pops. They got the dance to go with the song. They throwing up A sets. I fuck with it. It's very short. That was interesting. The Gap sweatsuits, if that's a thing for them. Or if the GAP means something. Just like how GS, GS9 was wearing like G-Star. Brooklyn's always been about their business. Like I know people who did like different credit card schemes and shit like that. Was driving Bentleys and shit. They hustle was different from like Harlem. Harlem, we could have been like some broke ass niggas, but still extra fresh all the time. But Brooklyn niggas like, they'll pull up with a white tee with a Bentley. You'd be like, how? Two, three bands, you think it's just me, little nigga. I ain't never gonna stand my hand. If we too deep with the whole block, be swear to God, I ain't never gonna feel my man. I see uh, Fat Boy. Fat Boy is a good friend of mine. Lil TJ was the, f like, him and, like, A Boogie was, like, the first to really embrace kind of, like, auto tune, kind of sing songy R&B, hip hop kind of vibe. And then uniforms kind of remind me of above, above the Rim. I see Jay Critch in there, too. He's dumb tall. <laughs> I think this is dope, like all of the, the younger guys getting together and doing this. It's fire, it shows camaraderie. It'd be like a, a lot of newcomers coming into the game. You don't know if they're just gonna be reckless and if they're gonna be responsible with their fame or their power. And like when you see these guys come together and they know how to have fun like this, you just know that like, all right, cool. Like these are the gate holders, you know what I'm saying? Like they. This game is this. I heard Gucci say the same thing. Like, if you can't embrace the youth and like the people that's coming in, then you're gonna be, you're gonna be stuck. Minnie's bitches look at her. Look how they thirst. Being popping, it's a curse. I knew Chinese Kitty before she was rapping. When she started making music, I was like, oh, word. Okay. Get it? This is my first time seeing this video, though. Minnie's bitches look at her. Look how they thirst. She look good in it too. She look dope. She sound dope. I think if she keep going, she got a, a real good chance of killing. It's a lot of um, competition, but you just gotta be confident in yourself and know that you can do it. I give it up to her and any anybody that's new coming into the game. Baby, welcome to the party. I'm off the money That's why I'm over retarded. That's why I'm over retarded. We gotta get him a silky off rip. We gotta get him, he got a poly on, we gotta get him a silky. These kids look like they from London. Sound like it too. I like the rawness of the video, like kids outside, after school. It's community, you get a sense of their DNA. Beat fire. Whoever made this beat, send me a beat in my DM, please. His voice hard. He like a Sean. You know how Sean was skinny with like a big, Biggie voice. Yeah, he reminds me of like from UK artists. Like they do a lot of track shoots in the UK. Like sporty looks. Uh, a lot of them is dark skin because they African. And his voice, his tone. I got black, I got white, what you want? Hop outside a ghost. Off rip, he reminds me of like a um a mine. See, the tribe he would be from would probably be like De La Soul or something. Because it's like, he's not changing the way he looks. He's promoting like himself and showing imperfections. Even though he's like, his video is really funny right here. I can see like this kid might have a lot to say. Yeah, he's a funny kid. He's not phased by anything. He's himself. He's a natural. He's from New York, wow. I'm like Colonel Lee, yeah. yeah. They said I'm tweaking, yeah. He remind me of Sid Vicious on oh, front. And if he's looking at Sid Vicious, he's a kid I can respect because he's doing his due diligence as far as 
studying music that's before him. That's where I get the name Fergie Vicious from, is Sid Vicious. What water they drinking in Staten Island? Wu-Tang and now this, it's crazy. Kids going hard. They get the face tat, they say, fuck work, I'm not gonna be a doctor, nothing. I think all genres fall under hip hop now. The new Green Day is Uzi. The new, like, Rakim is like Joey Badass. The new, like, Missy, Busta Vibes is me. Mixed with like some DMX shit. The new Slick Rick is Rocky. We, like I said, we all got tribes and shit. All of that shit is hip hop now, though. Yeah, I collaborate with all these guys because I could see a star quality in all of them. ABG Neil and Crime Life Cast. I fuck with those kids. Pop Smoke, I like Pop Smoke. Oh, I heard of him. All right, now I know who he is. I know his manager. Yeah, Pop Smoke. Oh, Chinese Kitty. She might have just been doing it for fun. And then people liked it, and she's like, let me just keep doing this shit. This shit is dope. I like Lou the Human. He reminds me of like a young Sid Vicious. I'm Fergie Vicious, so we got to fight for the title, kid. Out of all of these rappers, I would have to say I co signed Chinese Kitty. Just because I, I know her come up and she's like really good. Like she's actually killing it. I love the other people too. Like, you know, if I could co sign all of them, I would. But I only got one, so. Well, I was in my room, I was recording myself on GarageBand. That is? Yeah, I, re I recorded that song in my room. And I was sitting on my bed and it was like mad traffic noise at night. And I closed the window. But I'm like, damn, that'd be hard if I said that on the song. New York don't know how to be quiet.